ship's magic and it's growing all the time a new adventure waits for This railway faded into nothing more than a memory, and all its users forgot its mere existence. However, many years later, with the help of a little engine, the railway was brought back along with all its magic and other connections. So this is a story of one of those branches being brought back by the unexpected. Allow me to take you to a magical place, far away from us with talking trains and other things. This is the island of Sodor, and it is here where we, our story begins. Thomas is one of these engines. Hello! One day, Thomas was puffing along his branch line with a puzzled look on his face. His coaches, Annie and Clarabel, knew this and asked him why. Thomas, you seem to be lost in thought. May we ask why? Oh, it's, it's just that I'm curious about something. And what would that be? Well, I remembered the Magic Railroad and I wonder what other places used it when it was in constant use. This was a far, this was a good question. After all, he didn't see anyone but he and Lady use it. Until now. Far away in another world, there was a land called Equestria. Our story takes us to the town of Ponyville, where we meet our other band of heroes. We see a pony named Twilight Sparkle walking into the woods with five others. Are you sure there is something out here, darling? Yes, Rarity. Books don't lie. Yeah, remind me what that book said again. I told you all already. The book said that in these woods lies a railroad. According to legend, this railroad connects to another world. Like the mirror? Exactly. The group eventually reached a cave with buffers and a small set of rails inside. Yes, we found it. That's great, sugar, but uh, now what do we do? I'd say we go through this puppy. I agree. We must find what's out there. Now, who wants to go fur? Her sentence, Rainbow Dash zoomed through and disappeared, followed shortly by Pinky and Applejack pushing Fluttershy forward. Rarity slowly with a look of fear walked through the buffers. Twilight took one look behind her and then walked through. Twilight and her friends ended up on the other side fast asleep. After a while, Twilight heard whispers. Who do you think they are? And where are they from? Well, we can't well we can't ask them while they're asleep, now can we? Shh. Let them sleep. We can ask them once they come to. Fine. Wait, one is waking up. Ugh. Ugh, what happened? We're glad you six are okay. Th thank you. She said as she saw who was speaking. It was three talking engines, all of whom were staring at her. <sighs> it, it's okay, calm down. You're in a safe place. Wait, where, where are we? What happened? Calm down and let us explain. You are on the island of Sodor, and Thomas found you and your friends, and we brought you here to our sheds at the big station, the engine said, looking to a small blue engine with a number one on his side. What is your name, anyway? I am Twilight Sparkle. That's odd. Engines usually don't have last names. What? Something the matter? No, no, it's it, it's fine. Do you by chance have a mirror so I can see myself? There is one to your right. Twilight looked to her right and was shocked. There in the reflection was a pink and magenta tank engine with three big driving wheels and two smaller trailing wheels in the back. Also, she had her mark painted on her tanks. Wow! What is it? Nothing. I guess I haven't looked in a mirror in a while. She said, trying to hide the truth of who she was. 
Anyway, back to the introductions. I'm Henry. Nice to meet you. And I'm Edward. N nice to meet all of you. Do you know where my friends are? Yes, they're at the sheds to your left. I'll take you to them. So the two engines puffed off the sheds. Twilight's eyes opened wide. There in front of her all were all of her friends. However, they were all engines too. Rainbow Dash was on the far left. She had 12 large wheels on each side and a tender with her mock on it. Next, Twilight turned to a tank engine. It was Pinkie Pie. She was a small engine with three small wheels on each side and three humps on the top like a camel. Fluttershy was in the middle. She resembled an Atlantic-class engine with yellow paint and pink butterflies on her tender. Applejack was next to her. She had brown paint and was an 8F with many driving wheels and a long tender with her apple mock. Rarity was on the far right. She was an 060 saddle tank engine with diamond mock on her back. Hello, is everyone okay? Uh, I'm fine. I, I think I'm okay. What happened? Yes, where, where are we? After a few minutes, they realized who was talking. There in front of them was a pink and magenta tank engine. Twilight, is that you? Yes, and I'm not the only one who changed, I see. The five looked at each other and gasped. What, what happened?